Hi there, this is Oliver from Blendtoots.com. This video is not really a tutorial, but I think that some of you will find it useful because I show you how to get a recent Blender version, also called Builds. Blender.org is the official web of Blender from the Blender Foundation. It's interesting to check this web from time to time because you can take a look at the most important things happening in the Blender community. You can also download Blender from here. Okay? Or here, this is the version uh, 2.49, uh, but uh, only official releases. For example, you can go ahead and download Blender 2.5 Alpha 2 from here, but that's a version that has been released a few months ago. This is one of the coolest things with open source software, and is that you can keep track of the development at almost real time, and you can download the most recent version up to date with the latest bug fixes and new features. So here I have this web. You can visit it and you will see the most recent commits to the Blender source code, so you can notice at the moment if a new feature has been added or a bug has been corrected and so on. Now there are a few things that you need to know. The Blender development is divided in two main parts, the trunk and the branches. The trunk is, to say something, the base software, and the branches are experimental and in development new features over the trunk. When a branch is ready for the end user, it's merged on the trunk. This is quite important when you want to download a recent build. If you're not an experimented user, you may want to download the trunk, but if you want to test or help finding bugs on some new developing features or things like that, you can download branches. You're probably seeing here a feature that you were waiting for a long time or just want to have Blender up to date. So write down this commit number right here and you'll need this version or a newer one so you so it includes that commit. Now let's see how to download it. Here's graphical.org where some cool people is building the Blender source code for all of us on a daily basis. Now you can go ahead and select a build for your operative system click on it, okay, for example here I have Windows so this is my version uh, click on it and on the page that you will get here you can press on download build okay I have this already downloaded so go ahead and let's see what you will get you will get this file, a compressed file that you have to extract so you will get this folder here. Uh, what you have to, to do is place this folder where you want and inside it you will find this Blender executable. Okay, Blender.x. So double click it and here you have your new Blender build. Okay, that's it and you have Blender updated. <laughs> See you and happy blending.